know what a reserve is. I can reserve this book. <laughs> the Big Chico Creek Ecological Reserve. I haven't heard of that. Have I heard of the Big Chico Creek Ecological Reserve? No, I actually haven't. My name is Jeff Mott. My role uh, with Cal State Chico is Director of Ecological Reserves. We have two ecological reserves, Big Chico Creek, where we're at right now, and then the Butte Creek Preserve, which is uh, um, 100 acres along Honey Run Road. The ecological reserves facilitate learning by making a pristine environment like this available to them. You know, this is something that you just cannot get out of a classroom. To come out here and look at the native species in a natural environment is a fairly rare opportunity. And Chico State's very lucky to have this to offer to our students. Most universities don't have it. So we have um, a lot of student research going on. We have classes that come out on field trips at both reserves. In another sense, the reserve is a protected area. It's 4,000 acres here that um, preserves the natural environment and also uh, is very important to water in this area because this is a major infiltration area where the, um, the rain infiltrates the Tuscan aquifer which flows down under Chico so in terms of water this is an extremely important area to not just Chico but to California. I've never been out here, and it's really beautiful, and I didn't even really know this existed. We also um, have an annual fundraiser that community people come to, so they're able to support the students' efforts here in their research and their education. Um, we also have community activities, um, K-12 outdoor education, mainly targeted at third and fourth grade, where we offer community hikes for the public. So anytime someone wants to come out and um, learn about the geology, the natural history of the area, the plants and the animals. Uh, we have professionals that will, will take them on a tour. The future of the reserve is, I think, very, very bright because people now are more and more concerned about their natural environment. You know, you see large communities like the Bay Area trying to preserve those little pieces of land that are still left and undeveloped. And we have an opportunity here where we have more places like that that we can protect. So the reserve is one of those places that um, it will be protected in perpetuity and I think will become more important as population increases and, and climate change um, becomes more of a reality. And um, you know, it's a place for, for people to, to enjoy nature.